the nation of best architecture, the nation of modernity, and in the song industry, which I suppose it's represented by Eurovision National Selection and its winner, it's going to the past. Why is that? I don't know. Let's talk. What's up everyone, it's Jan Bors, new video and today I'm going to talk about Denmark, not the national selection, but just the winner because I didn't follow the national selection because last year I was a bit, well, I didn't find a song which I really like, even after that, Ove Post Hiranden, I really, really liked it, I really liked the live performance, I really liked the approach, the attitude, the atmosphere, you know, the feeling they gave me, even it was the song from the 80s European which it's not digestible for everyone, but, but I was a bit sad that it didn't came through the grand final. Anyway, this year is another song and another blast from the past. The song is called The Show and it's from the band called Ready. And when I heard it for the first time, I watched the performance, I was like, yes, this is a like old school ballad. I really like it. But then the twist came up and another girls came on the stage and they just start singing the power old school ballad. And I was like, okay, what's gonna happen with this? And there is no, you know, bad blood about this. I don't really care, but I was a bit sad that a country, which I, in my mind, have as the country of real, like modernity, like the modern approach in basically everything in music, it's going backwards. And not just in the way that this is the you know, a song which which more likely will fit 70s or or maybe 80s. You know, the rock proper proper. Well, they call it metal. It has nothing to do with it, in my in my opinion. But you know, the era of the Scorpions, Guns and Roses, and whatever this kind like Aerosmith, this kind of songs. And this is exactly what Ready is. And um, I must say, it's not the best of the best first of all vocally there is a space to be filled you know there is a space to do it much better life because there are sequences where i always say like oh there are some sequences of the song where i say like yes i really like it for the atmosphere which my parents was listening when i was really young kid and that's also as well great because you know eurovision is for all the generations Everybody will find a song there which they probably like because how diverse it is this year, that's crazy. And we don't have too much Eurovision songs as well, so that's another bonus, another plus for this song that it is original in the way that it's not the typical Eurovision stuff. It's not the typical stuff which I would say like that's made exactly by a manual for Eurovision, you know. This is not, this is a classic. This is a classical rock metal thing, rock metal song with all its rules, everything else, but it's just not the best of those songs. If such song can be successful, it must have the top-notch quality. It must be like the world hit, which is very not easy to be done, but at least it must be sung that great that you will that it will just overcome you. The problem with this song that the artists are not better than the song and that the song don't elevate. It's just, it would be much better probably in the headphones if you like this kind of music. But on the other hand, well, it's courage. It's courage from Danish public to vote for a song which has this kind of vibe and it's original and I'm a fan of this, you know, even I'm not a fan of the result. I'm the fan of this approach. I'm the fan of that everybody is given chance and that will open space to any other artists which like this kind of music and they really would like to do it maybe even better and maybe for some other country, it doesn't matter, but it just shows that such kind of genre really belongs to Eurovision too. And that's a really strong message and that's important message as well. So even it's not my favorite by far and I really think it won't qualify, but maybe it will, I don't know, but in my opinion, this is not the quality of for qualifier. Anyway, I'm a kind of fan of the approach and the energy it come from Ready Group because that's as well something what counts. But what do you think? Will they qualify or will they not qualify? Do you like it or not? And what do you think about what I said about the originality and the approach? 
because that's as well what I'm curious about how Denmark really thinking, you know, what Eurovision means in Denmark in general. I'm very curious about this, so write me in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and please don't forget to help Ukraine if you can, anyhow you can. I put some links in the description below so you can check if there is something what fits you. Of course, your government and your charity organizations that they already probably and very mostly probably had some their own channels and some their own ways how to help. So please do, even if it's super small thing, it's a very important. Every single small thing is important, super important. So please think about it. Please help them. I think who else needs it now? But it's up to you. I'm glad that you watched this video so far in here and I see you next video. Thank you for watching. Bye.